been sort of sighted out there, but we'll see exactly what gets found. And nicely done, Tywood finds another one. He moves into a very critical position, finds a third kill. Can he find up top? It is going to be dogs. And Delusional is down in trees. So what is he going to find here as he does get dogs? And that's a 4K. One more is left, and he's not going to be able to find him. It's unfortunate. Astrum has to pick up the last kill as almost an ace for Tywood. As he was running around like a chicken with his head cut off, yet still hitting shots. Absolutely well done by CUNE. 2-0 to start things off on attacker's side. As they find the initial kill onto Melkadict. And I think Melkadict's kind of been holding this spot here. And so I'm not sure exactly if Concordia is now just doing well and predicting it or what the deal is. But I pet dogs now probably looking to kind of smoke off here. Now, Concordia is kind of holding back. It's going to be a one-way opportunity here. And he is going to be hiding in wine. Nicely done as he finds two. St. Germain gets the shutdown on him finally. And Concordia actually will be down a member now here as things get started. Nicely done here. Tywood trying to find more. What more can he find? He's got finger guns, but he's done with it now. Small Potato gets the plant. Now Tywood finds himself a real gun on the back side. What more will be found here? Ender trying to find St. Germain underneath. St. Germain is going to stay safe for now. On the back side here, what more is going to happen? Nicely done there. Guys, that was a good blind opportunity. They're going to try and guess this. St. Germain finds one. Milkadick, though, on the back side. Can he get it? He does. And even with the defuse, or with the five kills from Dominguez Hills, they find the defuse. Defenders to win this round. And that was simply a rifles versus the bonus round, honestly, as a lot of those shots from CUNE were just not getting enough damage. And on the other side, Dominguez Hills had to only find maybe one to two bullets to find the kills they needed. But well done. And very well done on that hideout from iPet Dogs. I feel as if Concordia is not going to let that happen again. And it looks like he might be at least setting up for it. I would think he'd be kind of dumb to try it again. He's only, he only got a Spectre this time, so he's not probably going to go for it. He's going to set it up, find his nice one-way here. Doesn't find anybody, but that one-way ends up getting him killed. Right now, Concordia trying to find their way onto the A site, and they will do so. Ender throwing down everything he's got on the defense here. Nicely healed, coming through. Astrum will be planting, and Concordia now with their opportunity. Push it forward, and is this going to be a kill? Nicely done. Reactions finds that headshot. He's been looking for there. Right now, Concordia only losing Tywood. On a little bit of an aggressive push there, and still got three members up. Presence detected there. Reaction's going to be hiding down here in hell. They should be dropping down on him, but Small Potato has something to say about that. So we got Delusion here, as he's going to be found by Reactions on that backside. I think he looked away just after throwing that, and Reactions took a nice shot through to find him. 3-1, to one, Concordia. Now with rifles in their hands and full shields on their side. We'll see if they look for something different here, and they are going to. But I feel like Dominguez Hill might have actually a pretty good sniff out on this. Going A so long, you have to go B at some point, right? And the setup on B is going to be nice here from Dominguez Hill. I mean, when you've got... When you've got a Killjoy, it is absolute crazy to try and take this side and a lot of ultimates being used out of CUNE. That actually is going to be a big deal because Ender can't use any of his abilities. He's going to get found out. Not only that, Ashenhold is taken out. Melkadict going to die as well. And that is a lot of ultimates from CUNE used. Actually, I think almost like every single one, essentially. Pet Dogs is there. Tywood finds him, though, after being blinded crazy. Can he find this last one? Reactions finds it. Flawless round from CUNE. 
and literally all of them hitting their go buttons. St. Germain, the only one, along with Astrum, to not use their ultimates in that. Tywa Tywa also didn't. So I guess only the two. The Reactions, Ultimate, and Small Potato using his as they pushed forward all the way through. On the other side, Delusional used his and Ender. Um, not Ender, sorry. Just Delusional to use his on the other side. See, when he the very quick push onto B was exactly what they needed, and they stopped Ender from being able to defend this site well. So good job from CUNE, especially in that critical you little moment run. there. Now we're going to see as Concordia looking B again. They're going to use the Killjoy ultimate. And we're going to see exactly how this goes down on the backside, actually. This guy might be found out. He is. And so Concordia knows that one has been found. He's probably in the backside here. Tywood does get the kill on that side and uh delusional finds ashram actually hiding up there towards mid how much more are they gonna find delusional reactions finds ender though reactions looking for maybe a little bit more here find a nice kill onto melkadict and not only that ashenhold gets taken out small potato the last person alive is going to be blinded and he dashes right into him delusional era though finds the kill delusional era finding another one Opportunity, but St. Germain shuts down that opportunity. No problemo as Delusional finds a nice couple of kills there and does push forward. But Concordia able to finish the round 5-1 to one is where our score currently stands as we go to round 7. Defense is usually a pretty... Nice setup here on Ascent. And right now, I think not. I, I think how uh, the game was going before was a lot of those early peaks that Concordia has been looking for. Has Sorry. We'll talk a little bit after this fight initially goes down because right now things are looking a bit hectic. But... Ashram finding a nice kill, actually, in the mid part of this map. Finds Delusional Era, who's been sneaking up that direction every single time. Small Potato finds Ender, actually, with a nice little Elim. Or Ender, sorry, finding Small Potato with a nice Elim on that side of things. Right now, the wall goes through. That actually is going to be Tywood. He finds Ashenhold. I pet dogs gets the kill. Retribution on the backside. Nicely done there, too, for reactions. I pet dogs able to f come in. Finds the kill on the backside. It's not going to be quite enough as I pet dogs is trying to find his way around here, but he's kind of between a rock and a hard place. He's going to tap it again. Gets pulled in and concussed. Ashram finds the kill. That's another round in the books for CUNE. Nicely done. Six to one. Concordia leading as we go into round eight. Sorry, what I was saying before there was just a little comment about how on the last one with Icebox, it's a much more close range map. And I feel like uh, Dominguez Hill was really kind of protecting everything on short close angles and that was doing really well for them they had i think uh that's kind of their strength is they're able to hold those corners better and not allow anything long range meanwhile here concordia has been kind of guessing some of this and wow delusional with a nice shot there onto tywood finds the kill not only that though we're going to see concordia now pushing forward onto the b site that's going to be delusional as he gets nut or finds small potato but that was just his ultimate for the moment Concordia now trying to find a little bit more here as they know the operator is over there on the side. Delusional does have that right now. And nicely done here. St. Germain finds that kill. What was the Delusional going to find? Is he's kind of trying to aim uh, preemptively at a spot on site. A nice little cutoff there as Concordia now is going to move on to point. Looking, I think, directly at where the uh, door is going to get closed right in his face as he does fire a shot off. Tries to get this door reopened. Small Potato looking for an opportunity here. Gets the blind. Small Potato with a nice pickup there. Opportunity. Small Potato, though, can't get it. Pet Dogs gets the kill. 
Pet Dogs is going to be coming around, and he actually gets distracted by the bot. Going to get found out over on the other side. There's a nice flash coming through. It's delusional. Doesn't have the op anymore because he has to drop it off, but does get taken out by St. Germain. Concordia to win another round. 7-1 to one for CUNE. So, that was a big round for Concordia, and I think a big opportunity from, honestly, from Delusional to try and pick up some more. He found a really big pick onto Tywood to start things off, but then after that, with the op, wasn't able to get much more done. Yeah, he picks up the clone out of a small potato, but that just kind of helped put, uh, Concordia know exactly where he's sitting with the operator. I think they already knew it before just because of his location. Pet Dogs continues to try to find this, and he's going to actually be getting himself out of there as far as possible. On the other side, we are going to see Astrum with his operator <laughs> finding Delusional with that absolutely disgusting shot. Defender Killjoy does go down here, and Tywood trying to maybe look for it aggressively. However, Ender finds reactions. Milkadick does find Tywood. The spike is down. And Concordia trying to find a little bit more. They find one now with Small Potato. And oh, that's a very clo up close and personal situation there as Concordia goes down and actually will give this round over to Dominguez Hill. He should have kept out the shorty and instead switches over to the operator, but it's a very slow gun to get out of your pocket. And so Concordia actually will lose another round here, 7-2 to in round 10, as we've got three rounds to go before half. So we'll see exactly what Concordia can do here in these last three rounds of attacking. As honestly, they've been really good rounds, but very close. All around, I can't tell you of a round right now where Concordia has been able to kind of completely dominate. Maybe one or two rounds where they were flawless, but not. All the opportunities to illusional, losing out again on that fight with Astrum. Astrum now going to look on the backside as Concordia gets this mid-pressure. This is a massive thing on this map that I actually really enjoy seeing Concordia take advantage of. They're going to take all the mid-pressure, but not looking left is Reactions, and Ashenhold finds the kill there. Nicely done. That bot is going to find a little bit more. Tywood on the backside, though, does find a kill onto Pet Dogs. Nicely done there as they will take out the bot. Try to move maybe a little bit further forward here. Tywood looking for more here on the A site, but we're going to see a push forward here on the other side. Nicely done there from a uh, Milkadick as he finds the kill. On only that, Ender finds St. Germain as he gets found out. Concordia having a little bit of troubles here now suddenly. And oh, will he be able to find oh, Ender was right there. Had an opportunity to see it. Nicely done there as he finds Ashenholt. Can he find Ender? Ender sitting over there with the advantage currently. But he's going to be locked off for now. Ashram. Has this operator. Needs to get set up on the back of sight. Will do so. They know there's the one over towards defender's spawn. And nicely done here. Actually, a good run it back ultimate coming through here. This is going to see that. They want to find the guy. They know his location. Not only that, though. Small Potato is going to say, you know what? Forget it. I'm not using this just to sight things out. I'm actually going to find these kills. And I just don't know if they were prepared for him to run it from that direction. Might have thought he was back towards spawn somewhere instead of being on site. Nonetheless, Concordia gets the round. 8-2 to two now. And a round that I thought was going to be a little bit tougher for them to take. There they lost a couple of their key members, but they'll be right back in it here. Don't hold back. Round 11. So we're going to get things kicked off yet again, and... Concordia won't be giving away immediately where everybody is. They, of course, got to continue to stink and side out this position. And that's going to be a nice hold there, though, from iPet Dogs. Milkadek finds reactions on the other side. Nicely done, as they should be able to res reactions, though, from this. 
And they do actually get the res onto reactions. The plant going to continue to go down as it is going to be a 4v2 situation. Delusional is here. Looking for something, and he's going to be shot from Ashram. Ashram looking for another one. Actually just shot his toes on the first time with this big boy gun. Finding more. Doesn't see the drop. Ashram, though, will find him on the backside. Nicely done from Concordia. Ashram with his operator is being an absolute menace in the mid part of this map. 9-2. Round 12. Concordia with an opportunity one more time here. Try and get kind of some big shots and shut down Dominguez Hill and then go on to the defense side themselves. Where I think Concordia should do much, much better on the defense side of this map. Opportunity here is Concordia now trying to move forward. Taiwa taking a lot of damage. But we're going to see, of course, Ashram looking mid here and trying to keep things held on tightly. Not only that... Unfortunately, Tywood gets taken out. Delusional, though, does go down himself, so we're going to have an opportunity here. Where is that ultimate going to come through? It does come through on the backside of CUNE, but St. Germain sniffs it out. Finds the kill. Opportunity here. Ashram now watching mid like a hawk. And Concordia is going to move across through mid. They have the control, so they are going to take it here. Man, he is going to have a long reload there, but he gets it done. And now he's going to be continuing to look forward here on this site. Concordia going to get the plant down. And nicely done there from Ashram. I uh, misfingered, which I just hit the key that I wanted. Reaction's going to wait for Ender to run through. Ender runs right into him. However, he turns the corner too quickly, and Ashenholt does find the kill there. Ashenholt, last man up for Dominguez Hill. As that's going to be probably the end of this. He does get his ultimate off here at the last bit just to push through and find anything he can, but I don't believe he will find much more than that. He reveals himself even an inkling here. He doesn't immediately die. St. Germain will find the kill as all of them now will just die to the bomb. Doesn't matter. They all go down and round 13 is now here. Concordia with an opportunity to try to push this to an early lead if they can get the pistol round done. And uh, this is what I'm talking about with uh, St. Germain here on the B site. I mean, you're literally daring anyone to try and push this. If you're Dominguez Hill, you know that. You have the Killjoy on your side as well, so you understand how hard it would be to push that. They are going to go A. Putting on a pretty good couple of pings there onto the map. We can kind of show that here as they were sort of pinging a couple directions, I think, of where they're going to look for Concordia defenders. Tywood initially going to be up very close. And he's going to try to find this initial kill, but he's not going to be able to. iPad Dogs finds the shots back as Dominguez Hill now is going to try to push forward here onto the A site. Throwing down some good walls. Small potato. Try to throw some hot hands in there. Finds two with it. Nicely done. They spray through. Finds the two kills immediately back. He's going to take a nice guess here as to exactly where Ashenhold is. But Ashenhold should be able to stay safe for now on that side. Doesn't get the flash completely through. And flashes himself mostly on that. Concordia right now is going to be just sort of holding back, trying to find a little bit more. We have reactions pushing up mid here. On the front side, Small Potato watching one direction. Ender and Ashram finding another. Nicely done there from Small Potato. Does find the next kill. We have reactions on the back side. He is sneaking through. Will he be able to find these kills? And he does go around a little loud. Nicely done there. He finds one. He wasn't able to get the plant down, in fact. Nicely done there from Reactions. And Milkadict does know where he is. Ah! And the blind comes through. And Concordia able to find the first round on defense. 
Nicely done from C U and E. So, Concordia with an opportunity here to try to put things on match point. If they're able to get the win here, and it might be hopefully a much simpler opportunity. Right now, a lot of pings going on mid as Dominguez Hill might be looking to just take mid outright. Concordia not really going to be defending things initially. Going to be peeking at his reactions. So he does find at least one member of Dominguez Hill there. They will be pulling back initially just to try to find a little bit more. Meanwhile, on the back side, nicely done. Tywood finds the kill that he was kind of looking for. Sniffing out, finds another one. Ashram, by the way, on the other side, finding a kill. Nicely done there. Pet Dogs gets reactions, but the kill back does mean that Small Potato is the last one. Ah, they do find him. Tywood finally gets him taken out. Small Potato. I guess the last one to be on that site. Ready for it is what I really meant. Not the last one on the team. It sounded a little weird there, but match point. For CUNE, 12 to 2 on Ascent, and they are on defense. They want this very badly, and it looks like if this is a B push from Dominguez Hill, I am very ready to see it as Tywood is here, and he's ready to kind of fast peek this corner. They should have this sniffed out. Honestly, they should have it sniffed out because he did do it in the last round, so I would be very surprised. And they do sniff it out. Tywood gets the initial peak however he's initially going to get peaked taken out to start things off moving on to site is going to be dominguez hill nicely done there one shotgun but the next one doesn't find it concordia trying to find more ashram finds a pick on the back side this could be actually kind of a big pickup as he will find a rifle for himself here initially concordia breaks down the front door and run it back is going to be the answer to their prayers here. Nicely done. Can he find a kill? He actually gets a lot of damage down onto Ashenholt. This could be a big opportunity for CUNE. Nice pick there. Gets the kill. But with 26 health, I don't know how much more he's going to be able to take there. Ender with a nice opportunity, but he does take out or get taken out. He's not able to defend as the defuse will come through from Small Potato, meaning that Concordia will win. Defenders to win the game. Concordia will defeat California State University of Dominguez Hills 2-0 on Ascent and Icebox. We'll take a quick look here at the end game stats. You got Small Potato actually on the technical combat score win followed by reactions you got tywood actually the i guess higher rank on the team uh down at 14 and 3 so well done reactions and small potato and uh yeah everything looking good from the concordia squad so things now are going to be nice for concordia as this is a good opportunity to get this uh second win under their belt and uh all right well concordia will be 2-0 to start things off here in the necc Congratulations to Concordia, and good luck to uh, Dominguez Hill as they will go forward in their season. It's pretty early, and I think they've got a pretty good squad, especially on those uh, icebox maps. So uh, absolutely looking forward to see uh, how the rest of the season pans out for everybody. So GG's all around, and we'll see you guys. Uh, this week should be on, our next stream should be on Wednesday uh, for some League of Legends action. We don't know who we're playing yet, though, so uh, we'll let you know as soon as we know. But we'll see you then.